Hi, my name is Shannon Carrington. I am an animal specialist at Three Lakes Nature Center. This is the Marvel salamander. They are part of the mole salamander family. Their length is 3.4 to 4.3 inches long, recurring at five inches. They have a chubby body. They can either be black or brown in color and have the white or sable crossband on top. They are sexually dimorphic. So females have the gray or silver crossband and then males have the white crossband. The crossbands are not present in newly hatched juveniles. They usually have um, speckled flakes across their body. They can be found all throughout Southeast um, United States. They live in low-laying floodplains or wooded hillsides. Um, they are a partialized species, so that means that they stay underground and out of sight. They can be found under logs or rocks. Um, they are nocturnal, so they're mostly encountered when they are migrating to their breeding sites between September and November, mostly in autumn. Um, most small salamanders migrate in the winter. Males tend to arrive 10 days earlier than, than the females to the breeding sites. And they breed near fishless, temporary wetlands or venero pools. Females can lay between 30 and 100 eggs in a depression on land, which means they lay them in leaf litter. Um, eggs are correlated by body size, so the bigger female, the bigger number of eggs. Females stay with the eggs until the first rainfall, which encourages the eggs to hatch. Marble salamander is the only mole salamander that exhibits parental care. If there is no rainfall after the eggs are laid, then the eggs were over winter and then hatch later in the spring. Their aquatic larvae take between two to nine months to metamorphize into terrestrial juveniles and another 15 months for juveniles to reach sexual maturity. They can live up to eight to 10 years. Marble salamanders tend to eat micro um, zooplankton. They are preyed on by invertebrates such as dragonfly larvae or beetle larvae. They use the cover on the bottom of the pond during the day to stay hidden from predators and then they go out and about at night to enhance feeding and, and avoid predators. Marvel salamander eggs are preyed on by beetles, salamanders, frogs, and millipede species. Adults and juveniles can be preyed on by raccoons, possums, skunks, shrews. Um, newly metamorphosized animals are more susceptible to be eating. When marvel salamanders are being attacked, they tend to draw attention to their tail by tail lashing and body coiling and headbutting behaviors because they have poison glands in their tails to help them, to, to help them deter predators. Um, adult mava salamanders tend to eat worms, spiders, slugs, snails, centipedes, and insects. They hibernate underground during winter in areas not too far from their breeding sites. And scientists have been collecting marva salamanders during their migration to breeding areas by encircling breeding sites with low fences that guide adults towards small buckets buried alongside the fences, also called pitfall trapping. They are considered common and not protected in our region. However, species relevance on temporary wetlands and forested, forested habitats makes habitat loss a major conservation concern.